today we are giving the rescued snapping turtle from the construction site pond a massive upgraded home. This tub is literally taller than me, absolutely insane. This snapping turtle is one of the meanest snapping turtles that I have ever met. What? Oh, look at him. He just nailed it. Whoa! I think he's gonna love it. What is up everyone and welcome back to the channel. I hope all of you guys are having just an absolutely amazing day and for those of you that are new here, well, I'm Jacob and welcome to my jungle. I live here in sunny South Florida on a beautiful five acre preserve as you can see. Now if you saw the title and thumbnail, you will know for today's video that today we are giving the rescued snapping turtle from the construction site pond a massive upgraded home. If you see that ginormous looking tub thing, that's going to be his new home. I am so excited to upgrade them into this ginormous habitat. You guys have no idea how big this tub is. This is the largest tub that I have here on the property. I just picked it up from Mario at ZWF and this right here is the new snapping turtle home. So guys, this is, there's a lot of gallons in this thing, but let me know down below. Go right now guys and comment down below. How many gallons do you think this pond is? Because this thing is pretty big. Like, I don't know if you can get some like perspective on this, but like, I could literally totally stretch out in here, I think. Mario had this extra pond laying around and I need it for my snapper, so Mario hooked it up with this pond. We had a little uh, rain last night, so it's kind of filled with some water. I think the dimensions on this thing is like seven by eight. I'm gonna tell you guys right now how many gallons this is. This right here is a 750 gallon uh, pond. So I'm so excited to get this snapping turtle set up in his new upgraded home. So guys, I have the perfect location to set this incredible pond up at. So I'm going to hop in my truck. We're going to head over there and we're going to get this thing set up. So we made it to the back grove where we have Cheech, Chung, and China. China's actually settling into her habitat quite well. Hello, Mrs. Cheney. How are you doing today? So China got moved in here just a couple of days ago. She's absolutely loving life in the new habitat. But we're actually gonna be putting this pond right over here. This is actually where we're gonna be putting this pond. Lance is on shoveling duty and we're actually have this concrete slab that this uh, pond is gonna sit on. We have the pond right here. This is gonna be the perfect snapping turtle area. What do you think, Lance? It's gonna look great, honestly, with the shade covering and everything, it's gonna be nice. Yeah, so basically I have this shade cloth that was up previously. So once we have this pond up, we're gonna have a shade cloth completely covering it. We're gonna continue working on this area here and by the time it's done, it's gonna be perfect and ready for our pond. We just got the tub out and we're just lifting it on out right now. We're just gonna lift it and we're just gonna slide it right here, just like this. Now Gabe, I think we should lower it down. This is a massive tub. As you guys can see, I was not joking when I told you guys this thing was ginormous. As you can see, our tub is up. And we've actually gotta drain it. We gotta get all of this old debris on out, all this old mulch. We gotta completely drain it. You got it up right, Gabe? Yes, all right, sir. all right, push, 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 push. All right, we got it upright just like this. I mean, look, now that I'm standing here, this tub is literally taller than me. Absolutely insane. This is gonna be an incredible home for our snapping turtle. So guys, we've gotta clean this thing out and we've gotta fill it up with water. So to get this tub clean, we literally gotta spray the entire tub out. Gabe's gonna hold the tub up and I'm literally just gonna spray it out. Once we get it sprayed out, we're gonna have to scrub it down with soap and water because we wanna get all of this nasty debris out and we wanna make this look brand new. One minute, 37 seconds later. So we just finished cleaning our tub. It's ready to go. So Gabe, let's get this thing moved. So Gabe and I are moving this tub to its new home, to its new area. Whoa, okay. So this thing, again, absolutely massive tub right here. And I don't know how we're gonna fit it. I think we should just come right here, just like this. And I'm gonna get on on the inside right here. All right, all right. All right, we've got our pond. We're coming in, coming in hot. And, okay. All right, we gotta readjust it. As you guys can see, the tub is in place. And just so you guys can get a perspective of like how big this thing is, I decided to get inside. So this is our snapping turtle's new home. I am so happy with it. So guys, let's get our hose, let's get this pond filled up and let's get the snapping turtle in. So our pond is here and we gotta get this thing filled up. So I'm gonna fill it up. I'll be back with you once it's filled. One hour later. So as you can see, our pond is filling up. We're probably at about three to four inches right now. And we're gonna probably fill it up 
probably a little more than halfway. Now, right now, I need to get a basking platform for this snapping turtle in here. Now, snapping turtles, they're not really going to use a basking platform, but it's just something you want to have in there regardless for the snapping turtle so they can feel safe and secure. Something that they can get up on top of in sun to dry out because some turtles will develop a fungus on their shell if they're not able to fully get out of the water and dry out and kind of cook off whatever is on their shell. So... I've got our little platform right here now. I'm gonna have to get on in the water right now to get this set up. Now, I'm gonna do this platform in the center of this pond. So, I'm gonna put this one brick just like this, and I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna move this one right here to the side, and now I'm gonna get this brick right here. And now that this brick is centered, this is gonna kinda act as our main platform. So I'm gonna put this right here just like that and as you can see we have a perfect platform for our snapping turtle so now that i got this platform in i'm kind of seeing that we're only going to be able to bring it up maybe another four inches or so so the water line will probably be about here which is roughly halfway so guys we're going to let this continue filling and we're going to go get our snapper we're going to try and feed him we're going to take him out and we're going to bring him to his new home our pond is filled and it is ready for our snapping turtle now here's our snapping turtle right here now this is the one that we rescued, so he's just kind of hanging out in here. Now, he seems nice, but guys, this snapping turtle is one of the meanest snapping turtles that I have ever met. I'm gonna take this care right now, and we're gonna see his true chomping power right now. So, I'm not sure what's gonna happen, but I think he's gonna, oh, guys, he's moving his head. I'm gonna kind of bring him one, two, three. Guys, he bit the carrot. Now, I'm just going to kind of move him around, and I want to see if he'll bite through the carrot completely. As you can see, we're raising him on up. Look at this. Beast of a snapping turtle. I'd say this guy is probably at least 25 pounds or so. The snapping turtle nearly went through this entire carrot, but that's not all that we have today. I have a piece of chicken leg right here that we're going to feed to this snapping turtle. I'm going to try and see if this snapping turtle wants to eat this piece of chicken right now, so let's see. I'm just going to kind of bring it on down just like this, and guys, the snapping turtle can smell it. Oh, look at him. He just nailed it. He just ate the chicken. He actually took it kind of gentle. So here's this big old snapping turtle right here. I'm going to pick him on up right now so you guys can see just how big, again, that this monster is. About a 25 to 30 pound giant snapping turtle. And again, he's actually... Whoa! Whoa! Look at that. He just kicked and thrashed. And guys, oh my gosh. Oh, it's gone. He literally just ate the whole thing. So now the moment all of you have been waiting for, we're gonna take our big snapping turtle and we're gonna load this snapping turtle into the cart. We're gonna get this big guy ready to go into the new home. Look at this, there he goes. We've got him on in. Let's go guys, let's go. We're going. All right, guys, come look at this. He's got his mouth open. I wanna see if he wants to chomp this carrot right here. Let's see. Guys, I think he wants to chomp. Oh my gosh, look at him. Oh my goodness look at that guys he just took that clean chunk off and look at that imagine if my finger was there it'd be gone all right but oh my gosh did you see that this is one mean mean turtle you can see he's still got the carrot in his mouth he wants to bite this is one mean mean turtle so we're gonna release him on in his home right now the water's filling one two three there he goes in his new home. I'm gonna get in here with him. I'm not worried about him chomping my toes. If I were to get right in front of him, then that's when I would worry about him chomping my toes. But because he's away from me, I'm not too worried about this. Now this is quite an upgrade for this snapping turtle, giving him this ginormous 750 gallon tub. Well, this is the perfect habitat for this incredible snapping turtle. Whoa! I think he's gonna love it. Why you gotta be so mean, buddy? Dude, come on, be friendly. Be friendly. Here, come on your platform. I want to see him on his platform. That's where he's going to hang out in sun. He is released inside of here. Now, we're going to let him settle in, but first, we got to get a couple plants in here. All right, we've got our plants in here. Now, we're just going to put these plants. Now, the plants look kind of crappy right now, but it'll take these plants a couple days for them to start sitting upright, and we're not going to put too much of this in here because this plant specifically is going to reproduce, and it's going to fully take over the pond and probably make this thing totally green. So we've got our plants in. Our snapper is in. And well, that, my friends, is going to end today's episode. I hope all of you guys did enjoy watching today's video, giving our snapping turtle a brand new home. I think he's going to absolutely love it. But again, guys, comment down below. Do you think our snapping turtle is going to like it? I know I asked all of you guys to name our snapping turtle, but I never came up with a name. So comment down below a new name for him. And in the next video, we're going to pick a name. There you go, buddy. There you go back in. So again, guys, 
Thanks so much for watching. Give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below a name for our turtle. And if you guys are not subscribed yet, well, make sure you go right now. Hit that subscribe button, tap that little notification bell, and you'll be notified whenever I post.